So the first article I find when I search for this egg white face mask is from medicalnewstoday.com and they have a very detailed article on how to make this three ingredient face mask. Step one, identify the midpoint of the egg. Step two, hit this midpoint, trying to crack the egg in half. Step three, once cracked, tilt the egg to one side of the eggshell so that yolk moves into that side. Step four, use the other piece of the broken egg to trap the egg yolk. Step five, drain the egg white into a bowl underneath through the gap in the shell. That just took five steps to say, Separate the egg white from the egg yolk. That's almost like some YouTubers that take a three minute video and try and stretch it to be 10 minutes long. Hey beauties, it's Viviana and today I'm gonna to show you how to make a peel off face mask at home to remove blackheads. I hope. I've never actually tried this mask before, but Google and the rest of the internet says it works, so it should work. <laughs> so for this peel off mask, I'm only going to be using three ingredients, an egg, a lime, and some paper towel, which are all in my house already. So if it doesn't work, it's okay. benefits of using this egg white face mask is to nourish the skin, tighten the pores, and remove blackheads. And some whiteheads too, according to some people. Yep, and this is our homemade face mask. One egg white, half a lime, and whisk it together until it gets a little frothy. So one of the main reasons I was hesitant against doing this face mask was because the thought of having raw, slimy, stinky, egg on my face wasn't that pleasant however with the lime in the egg white it totally removes all the rawness from the egg it smells like lime but before I apply this to my face I am going to wash my face with some warm water but instead of just washing my face with warm water I'm going to do a steam treatment which is simply just dipping my face rag into some warm water and letting it sit on my face. So either washing your face with warm water or doing a steam treatment before your face mask is really good to do because they supposedly temporarily open up the pores so that when you do apply the face mask right after, it's able to get inside the pores and remove the dirt and the oil and everything that you don't want in your pores. I'm not sure how long it takes for my pores to open, but I just did this until the rag got cold. And I, oh! Yeah. Keep a rag very close cause this thing is runny and you don't want raw egg in your mouth. Ugh. But other than me risking my life getting raw egg in my mouth, this mask is kind of cool.
and I chose to use paper towel to make my mask but you can use regular tissue paper it's just that I knew the paper towel would give me a thicker mask and I figured a thicker mask would give me a better peel off experience and I oh can somebody google and find out if raw egg in your eyes is lethal This thing was taking way too long to air dry, so I finally got some use from my diffuser. Okay, <laughs> I can barely move my mouth, but it's time to peel this off. And according to most people, the best way to peel off a face mask is to go up. Yeah. I mean, I was expecting something a little more dramatic while taking off the mask. I don't know. I expected to hear like, and then like everything just suck out of my face. But now for the gross but strangely satisfying part. Let's see what came out of my skin. I see hair. <laughs> My god, my face is dry. Wait, let me wash off my face. Ooh, a blackhead. Ooh. And some, like, a few whiteheads though. Oh my lord. Oh, you can see that one right there. See there. Oh. if it's just that my face freshly clean or it was the mask but my skin look cool look bright maybe it's the lime <laughs> anyway beauties i hope you guys enjoyed this video and give me a thumbs up if you did and now this is the time that if you're new to my channel and you're so impressed to click the subscribe button you should do it now or if not it's okay i'll leave some more of my videos up in the i cards so you can watch more get more familiar with my channel and then after like the second or the third video i'm hoping by then you realize that you continue watching my videos because clearly you enjoy my content and we kind of vibe together So it just makes sense, you subscribe. Okay, beauties, thank you guys for watching. Later! Mwah.